45. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, Betty. Flashing them ankles. G'day everybody, Pertrol Gaming, and welcome back to another reaction video. Well, we've got something a little bit a little bit different, a little bit sad today. We found the news that Betty White passed away. 99, she almost made it to 100. Betty White has been in Hollywood for a long time, and she's been in all our hearts for a very long time. Uh, grew up watching the Golden Girls, um, like Placid, all those kind of movies she was in. Loved her, absolutely loved her. So somebody sent me this. Um, 21 quotes from Betty White that proved that she is the greatest person ever. I kind of want to react to this. So I thought today, um, to honor Betty White, let's do this um, 21 quotes. Um, we'll have a bit of fun and we'll remember Betty um, as she was a great person, great actress, and just an all round fantastic um, personality. So let's jump in and let's do 21 quotes from Betty White. Get me a cup of coffee. No, my name's Ryan. We've, we've, we've been working together for weeks. Months, actually. Months now. Dan, you've been a terrible assistant that whole time. <laughs> <laughs> it's because I'm not an assistant, Betty. I don't. I mean, I play an assistant in the movie, and I'm an actor in real life, and you should, you should, you should know when that. When Betty White says she wants a cup of coffee, you get her a, <laughs> a cup of coffee. You <laughs> ab-crunching jackass. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. I think uh, that is excellent. That is excellent. Sliced bread. <laughs> sliced bread. Could you buy sliced bread when Betty White was born? What do you think? No. I mean, I saw sliced bread been around for a long time. Mm. But so has Betty White. <laughs> no, I think Betty White was first. I'm so honored and so so thrilled and so scared because that's you? yes and and. For the Screen Actors Guild, SAG is the, is the you know, it's your peers. Mm -hmm. I wish they wouldn't call it SAG. I <laughs> wish they wouldn't call it SAG. <laughs> <laughs> At 90 years old, I was not expecting this. Let's right. put it that way. Just the way things have gone the last couple of years has been just fantastic. That's right. So I'm going to start lying about my age. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 45. You're 45. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa, Betty! Flashing them ankles! Is that really Betty White with six black men? <laughs> what? Even though you've made some crap, Morgan. <laughs> oh, that's the latest, but what I'm gonna have. Is, do you think that Tiger's wife, Elin, should take him back? Well, all I know, the only, my only claim to fame, I'm the only woman in the world who has not slept with Tiger. Oh. <laughs> and, uh, but no, John likes to do all his communicating via carrier pigeon. <laughs> huh? Carrier pigeon. Does that work? Okay. Oh, absolutely. Although, lately we've been having a problem with Sarah Palin shooting them down. No. <laughs> That is one crazy bitch. <laughs> I, I love how Betty just game, says right? whatever's on her mind. Doesn't matter. Just say it. Whatever. Right here. <laughs> I'm going to ask some questions. You fill in the blank, okay? Oh, okay. Okay, here we go. The real housewives should be called blank. The neighborhood hookers. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Thank you from the what? bottom of my heart, all those years that I had no idea I'd still be working through is so much thanks to you and your mothers and fathers, and <laughs> grandmothers and grandfathers. <laughs> <laughs> That's how old Betty is. And a couple of great grandfathers when I was younger. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've been around the block, okay? I mean, I've seen a lot of things, and I've done one or two, and uh, <laughs> I know a few things. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Not much, but some. <laughs> She's so deadpan. I love it. I just saw the most anticipated movie of the year, Deadpool. It was glorious. Once in a generation, a movie comes along that your whole family will love. If your family is a f***ed up group of f***ing kissing inbreds. Plus, Ryan Reynolds looks so f***ing handsome in his red leather suit. I give it four golden girls. How do you stay so Four alive? golden girls. I eat my favorite... I'm a health nut. My favorite food is hot dogs with french fries. <laughs> And I, my exercise, I have a two-story house and a very bad memory, so I'm up and down those stories. <laughs> is there something, is there one thing A two-story house and a very bad memory. What did I come downstairs for? I must be upstairs. <laughs> that Betty White still wants to do. Uh, Robert Redford. <laughs> you are more popular and... Wait, most... what was that question? That Betty White still All wants right, well, to do. Alright, just wait, we missed it again. I have memories, so I'm up and down All the right. stairs. Is there something, is there one thing out there that Betty White still wants to do? Uh, oh! Robert Redford. <laughs> <laughs> you are more popular and more successful, and you're working harder now than I think I've ever seen you work. Oh, isn't it? How and lucky you can I always all... work. You, you work. You work hard. You're in every movie. Well, I'm such a... I'm such a whore, I can't say no. <laughs> I love children. <clears throat> the only problem with children, they grow up to be people. And I just like animals better than people. It's that simple. Right? So you're like, and you know, he's like, okay, that's something I can grab onto. That's one little tiny hook. Something. Something. So I just started off, and I, for some reason, I felt William Shatner come over me. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Which happened. Oh, I wish uh, I could I'm, say If someone... <laughs> <laughs> You made the cover of Men's Health <laughs> in the UK, which, uh, and it's a very, look at that, build arms like this. Whoa. Fantastic <laughs> cover. Be are you okay, Betty? I'm, uh, I'm getting better. <laughs> <laughs> what, do you, what do you like to do in your free time? Oh, I like to, I like to do most anything, play with animals mostly, and uh, vodka's kind of a hobby. And, <laughs> Bike is kind of a habit. Hobby. What do you think about the state of our country and how divided it seems to be? It's very divided, and we're not in the best place we've ever been. But I think that's the time to buckle down and really work positively as much as you can instead of just saying, oh, this is terrible. Oh, he's terrible. Oh, just think, all right. There's nothing I can do about that right now, but I can do the best in my little circle. So if I do that, maybe you'll do your best mm. and, and you'll get through this. The category of Betty White Tips for Living a Long and Happy Life. Here we go, number <laughs> 10. Get at least eight hours of beauty sleep. Nine if you're ugly. <laughs> ah, doesn't hurt to go that extra hour. That's good advice. Uh, number nine. Exercise. Or dog, what the hell do I care? <laughs> <laughs> didn't make it either. You didn't have a dog in this fight. Uh, number eight. Never apologize. It shows weakness. That's right. Never <laughs> apologize. Number seven. The best way to earn a quick buck is a slip and fall lawsuit. <laughs> 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 uh, number six. Avoid tweeting any photos of your private parts. Uh, number six. That's good advice. Good advice there. Number five. Schedule a nightly appointment with Dr. Johnny Walker. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> number four. 
take some wheatgrass, soy paste, and carob. Toss in the garbage and cook yourself a big ass piece of pork. <laughs> That's good advice. Good advice, Betty. Number three. Try not to die. Exactly. <laughs> Number two. Never dwell on past mistakes. Especially you, LeBron. Thank you. Oh. Thank you very much. Ooh. <laughs> and uh, the number one Betty White tip for living a long and happy life. Don't waste your time watching this crap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she had some great advice, didn't she? That was good. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Um, a little bit of memories there for Betty White. Surely will be missed. But the good thing about YouTube and Netflix and all those streaming platforms, you can go on and watch Betty White anytime you want. So she will never be forgotten. She will never truly be gone because she'll always be there in our memories. Um, Betty White, we salute you. Thank you very much for all those years of acting and personality and service to the craft. You are in a lot of people's memories, as I said before, from movies that you've done, from the Golden Girls especially. Um, you will certainly be missed. 99 years, that is a good run in anybody's books. Um, you will surely be missed. Thank you very much, Betty. Um, but guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up as well too, guys. Make sure you enjoy your New Year's. If you have had it already, Make sure it's safe. If you're just about to have it, make sure you're safe as well too, guys. We'll see you back here in 2022. And guys, make sure I'll see you then in the next reaction video.